Good morning to you laddies, my name is Jack Jacksepticeye and welcome to Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Now I wasn't sure if I was going to get this game actually. I've, I've always been kind of a fan of the Assassin's Creed games. Assassin's Creed 2 is still one of the better games I've ever played. Assassin's Creed Brotherhood was really good but it didn't capture the magic of 2. Revelations was crap. <laughs> um, Assassin's Creed 3 was fucking awful. I don't care what any of you say. You can fight me to the death if you want, but Assassin's Creed 3 was shit. Nobody was more excited for that game than I was. The frontier, the snow, the forest, the nature. You guys know I love my nature. And I love snowy forests. That's the number one thing. If you want to sell a game to me, snowy forests. Just put that in. It's kind of why The Last of Us worked so well, because it has a section like that. Spoilers! Sorry. But... I was so excited for Assassin's Creed 3, it came out and it was so broken, the missions were shit, the characters were crap, the story was awful, I didn't like it and I, was, I wasn't sure if I was going to get this game. Uh, it was coming out for PC a lot later than it was for the console and I was thinking, hmm, I have some time to see now whether it'll be good or not for people's impressions to come through through forums and stuff like that. And they came through and people said it was awesome, it was more like Assassin's Creed 2, it was back to the good old Assassin's Creed. So, we're gonna have to see if that holds up. I've started the game, I've done the intro, and now I am in a city, and that's where we're gonna take off. Okay, Edward, let's see what's up. <clears throat> I literally started the game, did the intro, got to this place, did whatever mission I had to when I got here, just to keep it going. I kinda wanna go up there and get that, it looks so tantalizing. And then I stopped the game and came back here. So not a lot has happened, so you guys are like right with me. Uh, if you want to play the game yourself and you don't want to be spoiled, then I'd probably avoid this video. There might be some... S I can't get up anyway, dude. Oh, now I can't. There might be some slight... Fuck's sake! You guys are after me already! There might be some slight spoilers for the start of the game in this video because I might go and do a mission or two and just to see what it's like. I don't think I'm going to do a full walkthrough of it because a game like this is going to be gigantic and it's going to take forever. I thought it'd be a cool jumpy thing over here. So I might just leave it as kind of a first look thing if I find some cooler missions later. If I find some funny stuff, I might put that in. But for now, it's just going to be this video. This, of course, is the PC version. And my god, this looks very nice. Climb over that thing, you dick! Assassin's Creed, everybody! Buggy as all hell. Damn nice weather effects. I haven't seen this yet. The visuals for the most part are pretty shitty. I gotta admit. I seen the videos talking about it. That lightning lightning is nice. I saw videos talking about it before it came out, the tech that was gonna be in it, and it looked really nice. It did well then again sort of the Assassin's Creed 3, but this it kinda looks shitty from time to time. The character models are a bit crap, the repeated textures are a bit fuzzy. You have really weird water effects all over everything. It's kind of bad. Like, literally, it's on every single texture. on In the exact same way. I am going to nitpick the shit out of this game. Because I think Assassin's Creed games need to do a lot more to win themselves back in the eyes of players. Because they've just been the same stuff over and over again lately. And my sugar? Talk to Tweedle and the storm has stopped. One heaped upon another. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry, mate. This is my doing. I'm only trying to keep these Spanish eyes off me. Oh, it's no bother. All right, come on. Let's follow them and recover my maps. And my sugar? What? In my drawers? We'll see what happens. We'll try get your sugar there, little Tweedledum. I'm gonna call him that because I can't remember his name. Wait, I can tag enemies now? They glow even when I'm not in eagle vision anymore? Please don't tell me I can see them through walls. Are you fucking serious? I can see them through walls now? That's a big fucking no-no for Jacksepticeye. Far Cry 3 has it. Uh, it didn't it annoy me that much in it. The Last of Us had it, but thankfully I could turn it off. Tomb Raider had it. It annoys the shit out of me. Your games are not hard. Your game, Assassin's Creed games are piss easy. Why do you need to? Oh, where are you going? Why do you need to be able to let me see through walls? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm hiding in a bale of hay. I didn't even know that was there, but I'm just going to use it anyway. 
Where the hell are you guys? Okay, you're there. And the guys are stuck in the guards. And one of them disappeared and he popped out over there. That is fantastic game. Now the guards are after me for no reason. <sighs> okay. Hey, the guy. Ah! Leave me alone! Ouchie! Oh, yeah, I have smoke bombs. Smoke bombs for everyone! I am out of here! Do I have infinite smoke bombs? Get up! Ah, Jesus! Do not lose them! Don't lose them! Oh, for fuck's sake! Okay, there's no guards chasing me this time. I can just chase these guys. I'm sorry if the frame rate seems to like bug out a bit and it seems to go really low. The the game doesn't run the best. It's an Assassin's Creed game on PC. They all run shit, especially when they first launch. And this game just came out, so it might take a few patches for them to make it better. But Ubisoft. Whoever actually makes these games do not know how to code games at all. They can't optimize their games for shit. Like, the games don't even look that good, and they still run like ass. Man, I fucking hate the AI in these games. They either slightly work, or they don't work at all. I have, I've yet to play an Assassin's Creed game where the AI has been perfect. It's always been all over the place. Yeah, this is going to be a very down on this game video. It's already kind of annoying me. Uh, can I just walk into the middle of the women? How long will this hanging take, man? Ah, uh, here we go. Yep. Don't do what you want. We we will give you the illusion that you'll actually be able to play the game how you want. You are this cool assassin running around. Well, I'm not an assassin yet. Running around inside this big sandbox, but no. You'll only be able to do the way that we let out. The obvious way that we have set out for you. Yeah, don't mind me. You can't see me. I'm just the only guy in a hood with swords surrounded by women. Walk faster, girls. Walk faster. Our target is upon us. Can I just like stab him and go? What do I have to do? Tail the. Oh, I just have to tail him. I don't even have to do anything. Maybe that's why it was so easy to get up to him. If I actually had to kill him, he'd be surrounded by 50 million guards. <laughs> and distract all the guards. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Just leave your outpost. Just like that. That easily. <laughs> ah, shit! This is not going well! Do not kill the women! I just... I just loot his body? Yeah, that's how I roll. To victory! Ow! My ankles! Okay, I have to sneak in there. I thought I was gonna land in the water. Hmm. Is there like a really obvious way in like there always is? No. Oh wait, yeah there is. The guard is just gonna let me go past, right? Right, Mr. Guard? Right, yeah, good boy. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way. I really, really want to love Assassin's Creed games. I am fucking awful at this one, apparently. The idea behind Assassin's Creed games is so good. Being able to... Being able to free run everywhere like that, being able to assassinate guys, sneak into places... It's all so cool, but it's... It's executed so badly. WHY DID YOU JUMP DOWN THERE?! Okay, I'm gonna fail this because I want to do it right. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Shit, tacky! 
Ah, shit! Jack, it says sneak in! Uh. I wanted to jump off the fucking thing, but he wouldn't. Now he does! Good job! Ow! Shall we try it from a different angle? Oh, I think so. If the game doesn't want me to do it, that other way. Oh, don't climb. It's okay. It's not what I wanted to do at all. Don't worry. I know it's a restricted area. I've been here twice. Is there a secret way in over here? I'm gonna try anyway. Hopefully there'll be a way to climb up. Hey, there's something over here. Nope, nope, nope. You're not allowed to go that way, apparently. Okay, there's a way to climb up just over here. And we're supposed to climb these ones. Like this. And then drop onto this one down here. You better land on it. Okay, good job. Over here. Oh my god, get up! Can we do it? We're not in the place we're supposed to be in yet. Almost. I want a gun. Can I take that gun? Is it down here? You didn't see me. You didn't see me, I'm invisible. I'm invisible! You didn't see me! Yeah, now you didn't see me. Okay, that guy's coming over, okay. Whistle, whistle! Yeah, it's coming from over here, stop looking around you! And spadoosh! Ah, the place isn't even down there, it's up here! What the fuck was I doing all that time? Come down. There's someone down there who called your name. Yeah, I think his name was Frank. I think that's what he said his name was. How do I deal with this dude? How do I deal with this guy? I might not even have to deal with him. Nope, I will. <laughs> He's gonna sit there. You don't you don't care about the guy that just jumped up in the ledge in front of you? Ah, oh, Jesus! Oh, does that count? Yeah! I did it! Finally! Whee! There was a rock right there! If that was real life, you would have smashed right into it. No amount of water would have stopped you at that speed. <laughs> now that mission's over, let's go do some, something else. What, what are you doing?! I didn't even point you in that direction! I was pointing you to run around this stuff. And you keep bouncing over everything. Stop it! Oh my god, just run in the direction I want you to run in. I see they did not fix the free running. Still as broken as ever. I want to climb that thing and follow him, but it won't let me. Climb this one. Okay, the chase is on. Eventually. That guy just teleported. Nice. Do not go in the water. Where are you going? Yeah, I got my money back. And smoke bombs. You know what would be much better than smoke bombs? Dicky Bobs! Hello, Mr. Pigeon. Who's sending out these things? I have not talked to anyone in this game yet about doing assassinations. I have- I'm not even an assassin, I'm a pirate. This makes no sense. All of a sudden I'm just finding a pigeon in a coop out of nowhere. 
And I get to do an assassin. Whatever. We'll roll with it. Another thing that I didn't know about this game until I actually started it up was that the Animus is back. I know it's kind of stupid to think that a, an Assassin's Creed game didn't have the Animus in it, but... I had seen nothing of the Animus in trailers, in hype talk, in any previews, anything like that. And I went into the Animus and it was all first person. The person I was playing as, you had Desmond in the older games. But in this one I was playing like a nameless, faceless, bodiless protagonist. I was just walking around in this little, this little office where all the Animus systems were and it was all in first person which was really freaking odd. I'll drop! Go away from me. I... Why? Why? This game makes no fucking sense. I was on the roof, you told me to get off. I did, you followed me down. I said some bitches are gonna die. Ah, stabby stabby slashy smashy. Hey, hey dudes, I'm gone. I didn't mean to do that at all. I wanted to run down the street, but... This will work. This will work. That was all complete accident. That was all because the free running didn't do what I wanted it to. Let's do this assassination contract, seeing as I messed up the last one. I mean, the game messed up the last one. The game, the game, not me. I was awesome. Hey! Hey friends! One thing I will give the Assassin's Creed games credit for is their shadows. The shadows, well I can up them even more to make them look even better, but I didn't cause I wanted the game to run well for the video. But everything has shadows in Assassin's Creed games. Like all the people over there have shadows, these guys have shadows. When you're running along rooftops and you look down onto the ground you can see your own shadow. It's, it's really quite cool, but... Yeah, the rest of the visuals look a bit sketchy. Like the stuff all around me right now, right in front of me, looks nice. But everything in the distance then looks cartoony. It looks shitty. It looks fake. It, it doesn't blend well with the rest of the environment. I'm gonna hire you, hire you bitches, cause yeah, cause I need you. Let's walk a bit faster now. A bit faster now. Where's my target? There he is. That's him. The black dude down there. The guys got distracted and then they just walked off. <laughs> they just get distracted. I don't even have to send them. And you are dead. Did I really just get away with that? You guys saw me do it in front of you! Oh, now they're after me. Are they? I think they are. Yep, the chase music is on! Through the wilderness! Ah, oh, this is very nice. I will give the game credit for this. This looks awesome. And I like these areas that you can hide down in and stalk around. They make no sense because the enemy should be able to see you because you're right in front of them, but they do look very nice. And they do make you feel like a badass. And you get to do stuff like that! The only thing I don't like about them? Yes, imagine I don't like something else about the game. Is that they feel a little... They feel a little placed. I know they are, but they, they look like they're placed. This doesn't. This is very, very well done. This is very nice looking, but there were some areas at the start of the game where all these patches of grass were all laid out perfectly to take down all the enemies on their patrols. That kind of stuff bugs me, but I'm gonna leave this video here. I've been playing for a very long time and you guys can get a feel for what the game looks like. If you guys like Assassin's Creed games, if you enjoyed Assassin's Creed 3, you will love this game. Uh, it's very much the same, but now it involves pirates. It's not as shitty as the story was in Assassin's Creed 3, not so far anyway. So it's, it's pretty decent. I don't really like it personally because the mechanics are still broken. The game does not look like a next-gen game, but that's what you do when you make it for the PS3 and the 360 and then you bring it to next-gen as well. No, just cut the fucking tie with last-gen already. 
bring stuff to the PlayStation 4, the X1, PC only. Stop living in the past. Um, the game doesn't run well on a PC. If you're looking to get this on a PC, I'd wait a bit and wait for patches, wait for new drivers to come out. I'm playing this on a GTX 670. My GTX 780 Ti will be here next week. Oh, that my computer's gonna fucking blast any game that I put in it. It's gonna be phenomenal. But yeah, that was Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. I don't know if I'm gonna do any more videos on it. The game kind of pisses me off. I'm not a big fan of it yet. But later on, nighttime is looking very nice. But later on, if stuff gets a bit better, I will play more of it. If I, if I feel there is more to add to the game, if I feel there is more to show of the game, I will do more of it. But for now, that is the video. But thank you guys so much for watching this one. If you liked it, punch that like button in the face like a boss! And high fives all around. Thank you guys, and I will see all your dudes! Jump from the cargo lift while it is in motion. We'll cause death. Can you take a the cargo lift? Thousand dollars. Can you take jumping off the cargo lift? Five thousand dollars. But if you jump off, you will die. Looks bad. I think we have we've gotten up on the run. I'm not.